Interim Chancellor Barbara Wilson announced Monday Athletic Director Mike Thomas was fired. Wilson cited that Thomas was a distraction to the athletic department. She says the well-being of athletics was a priority. I would say, you know, since I took this position, I've been thinking hard about athletics. Uh, they were issues that came to me right away. And so I've been weighing all the information, looking at all of the uh, preliminary reports and the uh, recent reports. So it's been on my mind for a while. Thomas was released after an investigation into the football program found that there was mistreatment of players. The interim athletic director will be Paul Kowalczyk. He says that moving on from the controversies and investigations are paramount. I'm going to approach the next couple of months day to day. Uh, again, trying to, trying to steady the course here, make sure everybody knows we're in this together. We're going to get through these challenging times. Uh, we've got a bright future ahead for this university, for this athletic department. Um, that's, that's what I'm focused on right now. Interim head football coach Bill Cubitt said that he will deliver the same message to his players after Tim Beckman was fired earlier this year. They're pretty strong. You know, we try to make them strong. You know, we talk a lot about you know, our number one thing, one of our number one thing, number one thing, number one thing, don't flinch. Something's going to happen. Something's going to happen every day. Like, something's going to happen out there. How do you handle that? Uh, we talk about don't flinch. Like, we, talk, we talk more in football terms. Uh, during the games, get ready for the game. There's going to be there's going to be curveballs thrown all the time. That you know, you there are two lawsuits still pending against the athletic department. One is from seven former women's basketball players, and one is from former soccer player Casey Conine. Masaki Sugimoto, the Daily Illini.